Hey guys and welcome to another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to connect to a PPTP VPN uh, or other VPNs on your Mac OS um, computer. So the first thing we're going to need to do is um, go to System Preferences and we can do that by clicking on the Apple here and then going down to System Preferences. And uh, when we're in System Preferences we then have to look for Network. So in the middle here you can see we have Network. So I'm going to head and click on Network and uh, then we can see I have PPTP because I already have one configured but what you would need to do is uh, press the plus here on the bottom left and then create a new interface so we're going to create a VPN interface and then you need to choose the type of VPN um, I'm going to be using a PPTP connection for the purposes of this um, so my service name is um, whatever I want to call it um, what my adapter is and we can have multiple VPNs for this VPN type so I'm going to go ahead and click create and then I can go ahead and type in the credentials I have. The first thing you're going to need is a server address. This could be a DNS name or it could be a, a number. Um, so for argument's sake, let's just put in uh, vpn.myworkplace.com. Uh, my account name might be Matt. Um, encryption, I would leave it on automatic for now. If you have problems, you can speak to your sysadmins and uh, maybe get that changed. And then we need to type in authentication settings. This is if we wanted to remember the password for us. Um, so let me just type in let me in. And uh, we also want to show the VPN status in the menu bar. That's really handy for quick connecting. And um, now I'm going to go ahead and click on advanced. Uh, one of the things I'm going to do is send all traffic over the VPN connection. So if you don't have this ticked, it means only the traffic destined for your workplace will go there. So if you're browsing the internet on YouTube, um, that will go via your connection. And if you are trying to access a folder on your work account, um, that will go over the VPN. And it will, it will know, uh, based on the IP address or what subnet it's in, where to route the traffic. Um, however, if you just want to send everything over the VPN, you can click that. Um, for my purposes, I actually need this because um, I need to access something via work which could be accessible from home uh, but I need to do it via work to, for it to let me in so I'm going to go do that and go ahead and press OK and as I've done these I've got this ticked here and I'm going to press apply OK again so I'm going to go ahead and close the network tab now and now I've closed that I can go up to the icon I have up here which is the VPN one and I can click it and I can see the different connections I've got under each um, under each adapter that we've created. So um, I'm actually going to connect to work, which is a different one, which I know works. Uh, I'm going to tick that um, and then I'm going to connect it. As I've got the password saved, it's just going to dial up and you can see it's connecting and it's going to go through and I'm now connected. Um, I hope this has been useful for you. Thanks for watching and if you want more videos, please subscribe.